DJ, cause that's my DJ. I say go DJ, cause that's my DJ. So y'all, a fan, a fan just said that Polo G fell off, right? And it blows my mind how people could say that when he just had the number one song in the world, bro, like a rap star. You feel me? So we about to check out DJ Academic's response to a fan saying Polo G fell off. I was just gonna watch this myself. I'm like, you know what? I should definitely bring y'all along with me. So let's watch it together. Uh, if you've seen it, you've seen it. If you haven't, let's check it out, man. Let's see what they got to say about this. I definitely want to hear what Act got to say too. Cause sometimes academics just be talking, bro. You feel me? Like I rock with academics, but sometimes he just be talking, son. Like just be talking, bro. I mean, like he do be speaking his mind. There's nothing wrong with that. But it's just like, bro, chill out. You feel me? Like I don't know. He's just it's academics, bro. I don't know. It's like, you just can't really say Yo, nothing. Polo G do really got, like... Hits. I'm trying to see what the ceiling is of Polo G. Admittedly, I've never been the biggest Polo G fan in terms of, like... I've seen people just say, like... Like, for example, I think this came up recently. What's the new school of hip-hop? Let's talk about that. Yeah, let's talk about it. So, again, obviously, you know, uh, historically, when people thought about the new school, there was like, yo, yo you got Cole, yeah, Kendrick, Kendrick, you got Drake. Big Sean. Like, you know, like, trying to throw Wale and a couple other, like, you know what I mean, niggas in there. But um, they, they were trying to create a class, right? right? The new school of hip-hop. Basically saying the new generation of the, uh, uh, the new generation and the new niggas that's running shit of that generation that we should look out for in being legends and you know dominating right and i was reading a bunch of people's lists i forgot which post on my instagram it was and i've seen a lot of people mention polo j i'm gonna be very honest yeah he's he, he running his game you feel me he's and, the new generation right here fuck i do fuck with him i fuck with polo g but i'm like so the whole time i'm looking i'm like what am I messing with Polo G? Is it that song? Like that one song that, oh shit? Nah. Is it that one project? Mm. Yo, I forgot to let y'all know this, man. I will be doing Polo G, Dia Legend versus The Go. His first album versus his second album. I want to do that album before Hall of Fame comes out. You feel me? So make sure I get this video to 3,000 likes. If y'all want to see that video, I want to do that video before Hall of Fame come out. I want y'all to hear my opinion about both projects, you feel me? Um, to Die a Legend, to Go, and then the new album that's coming out, Hall of Fame. So, y'all let me know in the comments, man. And y'all y'all can let me know by liking the video. Again, this video is 3,000 likes. And when we do that, I'm going to drop the video for y'all, man. But let's hear what Act got to say. Because Act talking about something, it's not that. I'm not waiting on that one song from Polo G. It's not that one project. So what he trying to act? Do you rock with Polo G or not? Isn't like you trying to make this a whole big deal? Like, what is that thing about Polo G that got pe everybody say this name? He's a lyricism. You feel me? The way he come on the mic, he just be talking his ish. Because I'm asking, what's the new school of hip hop? What's the new school? So if you ask me, Cause like I... Polo could do it all, bro. Like he could go melodic, he could do drill, he and, and he can rap for real. Like he his lyrics is not even like below average or nothing like that. It's like it's real high, bro. I'm I can't really compare Polo G to nobody though. You feel me? Like you know how people be like, oh Kendrick is like a Cole, Cole is like a Kendrick. Sometimes you feel me? Like people be comparing like the the new like. Like, when Cardi came out, a lot of people was comparing him to, um, you know, one of the greats, you feel me? Like, I don't know who I could compare Polo to, though. I'm not going to lie to you. I really got to think about that for a fact. That's tough. Because I'm asking, what's the new school of hip-hop? What's the new school? So if you ask me, this is what I'm going to say. The new school of hip-hop right now. I think young boy got to be in it. I think baby got to be in it. And when I'm talking about new school, again, I'm not talking about the hottest rappers. I'm just talking about if so, if an alien landed on Earth today and they said, yo, what's going to be popping or which artist that's lit now will also be lit in 20, I don't know, add, add seven years, 2028. Or no, let's not even go seven years. Let's go five years, 2026. 
right? So you telling me Polo G is not gonna be popular in, in, in five years from now? Are you stupid? What is I trying to say right now? So you telling me Young Boy is gonna last longer than Polo G? That's what you're trying to say? Oh snap! I don't know. Add add seven years. 2028. Okay, seven well, years no, from let's now. Let's not go seven years. Let's go five years. 2026, right? Because a class in high school is like four years. I'm saying take young boy. No, we're not saying Drake. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. Drake had his class already. Yeah, Drake definitely had his class already. Drake, Drake done graduated like doctorate. Like he's just whatever. <laughs> right. I'm talking about new niggas on the block that you think is going to last. Like, if it was an NBA, you'd be like, yo, the new school, the niggas who run in the NBA is like Zion. Yeah. I don't think it's but, but a couple other niggas. I don't know. I don't watch sports like that. Yeah, anyway. I, I see what you're saying. <laughs> um, yes, I'm thinking. So if I'm thinking like that, who am I rocking with? Who y'all rocking with? Five years from now. Uzi? I feel like Uzi kind of had his, like, Uzi's a veteran now. Yeah. You know, you know what I mean? I, I guess that's what I'm saying in terms of classes, right? So, like. Yeah, I get 20... what you're saying. I get what he's saying. Now, you can't put Uzi up there. Uzi already had his class. You feel me? Like, Lil Baby, for a fact. Polo, TJ, um, Corey Day, you feel me? Um, it's a lot of niggas that I can't think of right now. I'm gonna map the music real quick. I see what he's saying though. I see. I definitely see what he's saying. Uh, do y'all think Rod Wave go last and fight? I think so. I think so. I'm not gonna lie. Roddy Rich, you feel me? Like, where Roddy Rich? Um, did Tory Lanez have his little? Tory Lanez have his class already? I think I'm gonna say Tory Lanez has had his class already. I'm gonna say Dirk had his class already too, but Dirk is now getting that recognition. You feel me? So. Ah, that's tough. That's tough. G Herbo. Did did Herb have his class already though? Ah, that's tough. That's tough. 10 2011, we had that new school with Kendrick. Who? Oh, Drake. And that kept on going. And I think around like 2015, 2016, we started seeing a new like another school mm -hmm. kind of form. Like, you know what I mean? You had, like, the left-back king, which was, I think, future, because future... All right, let's do it. A class is five years. A class is five years. Don't say Uzi or Kodak. They're in the 2015 to 2020 class. They came out 2016, right? So 2015 to 2020, that's their class. They did it. They're veterans now. They're mm -hmm. veterans. We're talking about what's the new school, the new generation. Who y'all got? Who y'all got? What's that? Who's going to be around for the next five years of 2025, 2026 running this shit? Rod Wave. I like that. Young Boy. Lil Baby. Rod Wave. I got three. Roddy Rich? Yeah. Okay. Somebody says Corday. Mm, look, look, look. Hey, I know what I'm talking about, bro. I know what I'm talking about. You feel me? Corday's definitely going to be here in five years. Stop playing with me. I How you feel about Corday these days? So this is gonna mm. Hell no. Ew. Yo, look, Corday is not consistent as much, you feel me? But when he dropped, you gotta take a listen to it. You feel me? Like, you definitely gotta take a listen to what Corday is saying. He's not why you think he separated himself from the YBN clan, you feel me? Like, that's not his thing. You feel me? He's a lyricism. You feel me? Like he can rap. He's gonna be here for a long time. Aggie's probably bugging right now, bro. Gun is not nah. I don't is know. Is this about disrespectful Gunna. to say, Chad? I think Gunna might be the Wale of the new school. <laughs> You're like no real talk. You no, know he got the talent, but like it's just something about it. It's something about it. It just don't all the way connect. And nah, I feel it. I feel it. It's something about it. Is I know it's one of. I know he got the drip. I know. I'm sorry. But music, music is about longevity, though. You feel me? Like that's really what it's all about. Like I, if I could listen to the music now, and then if I could listen to it two, three years later, you feel me? That's why Drake is so relevant and still 
going strong in the game because his music is just like it. It still hit the same. You feel me? Like it, it, it ages well. You know what I mean? Like I could listen to a Drake track that he made in 2010 right now and be like, damn. You feel me? Like yo, it's bars that niggas is now catching that Drake made five years ago, bro. You feel me? So that's why I see Polo G. You feel me? As one of those dudes that's gonna be in the game for a long time, bro. Like if you go back and listen to Die a Legend, his project that he made in 2019, you gonna be like, damn. You know what I mean? Man, Polo G gonna be here in the next five years, bro. Like he, he's definitely the new school wave, bro. And how, how he gonna say no disrespect to Lil Baby? I rock with Lil Baby, but he's comfortably saying Lil Baby. You feel me? But not comfortably saying Polo G. Like how that work? That's mad confusing, bro. <laughs> Smirk. Yo, Smirk is a nigga who got left back every grade. <laughs> nah, that got it. Now he's 28 in the high. He's 28. He's a 28 year old senior. He got left back in first grade. So he's in he, he first grade twice, second grade twice, third grade twice, fourth grade twice. That nigga was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, I got fun. it. <laughs> I can't wait to start. Oh, um, <laughs> streaming. <clears throat> wait, did I let y'all know that I'm dropping a new intro for the channel, season two? Yes, sir. Yo, when y'all see this new intro, y'all, y'all is going to love it, bro. Yo, if you follow me on Instagram, you will be one of the first people to see the intro, man. So make sure you follow me on Instagram. Because this intro, y'all... Jeez, I'm still keeping the Go DJ one, like the Go DJ, but the creative idea about the intro and everything about it, bro, is clean, man. When I get my hands on it, y'all gonna see. I done is lit, bro. No cap. Yeah, season two. Hey, boogie's wash. <clears throat> oh, I forgot about boogie. I ain't gonna lie to you. Sleepy Hollow. Ooh, Sleepy and Chef. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, Ag didn't really say too much, man. Uh, he didn't really say too much. He just want to know, like, what's the new school way right now? Like, in five years, who y'all who y'all going to say is still relevant, man? I definitely want to know who y'all picking. In five years, you got to pick, I don't know. Just let me know. I, I can, I'm not going to give y'all, like, pick five people. But, like, five years from now, bro, who y'all think is still going to be relevant? Who is going to be carrying the new school? Me, I'd say Lil Baby, Corey Day. Um, Polo G, Lil TJ, A Boogie, um, Roddy Rich for sure. Hold up, you can't forget about Roddy Rich. Um, I don't know, Chef G and Sleepy is a wild card for me, man. Like, I see them still being here five years, but it's like, uh, I don't know, I don't know. That's tough, that's tough, but definitely I want to know who, who y'all picking, man. Um, uh, so y'all let me know y'all thoughts about that, man. Like I said, season two. Of the new intro is coming out very very soon, man. I can't wait for y'all to see this work, bro. Oh uh, man, I'm excited for this new intro, man. This new intro is really gonna be like, yo, this is the beginning, bro. Like, you know how we hit 100k? I'm telling y'all, this is the beginning. Yeah, this intro is like, yeah, we, we getting started now. You feel me? Like season two is about to be litty. But yeah, man, I love y'all. Leave a like on this video, man. Uh, Polo G, Die Legend versus the Ghost coming out soon. Y'all let me know if y'all want it, and I'm out of here.